Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. We're trying Sellings. Uh, this is in collaboration with the uh, <laughs> Game Development World Championship and uh, Struct9 that provided me with a key. Thank you all very much. You can check out the Game Development World Championship site for a bunch of indie games and uh, maybe some undiscovered gems. And if you're a developer, you can uh, submit your game and there's still time to submit your game for some potential prizes. Oh my God. Let's check out Sellings. This game, uh, from a cursory glance, looked like Spore, but just the cell stage. Species name, okay. Abigus Simpus. Wait, gotta do two Gs. Biggest, uh, biggest Simpus. There we go. Um, heck yeah, but I love purple. All right, let's uh, let's let's get let's get this going. This game has a very zany uh, like art style from what I saw, which I'm all for. I all I love that zane, you know. I love that zany kind of like Saturday morning cartoon vibe. What is happening? Uh, uh oh, Lo life is forming. That's the big oof, honestly. This uh, I gotta say, these frame rates are a little bit jarring. The game, it seemed to me, was very simple. Welcome to the neural adapt, uh, adaptation stage. This is the very first generation of cell evolution. Eat and adapt. Follow the main task line on the far, on the left side of the screen. Use WASDA. To hold, uh, hold left shift to speed up and look around with the mouse. Avoid bigger cells and eat to grow. We got just a lot of stuff going on right now. Right now we're in the Adar. What was it? What was that game? Agar IO, Agario, and there's a that was quite the like five years that that game was like just intensely popular. Um, yeah, and now whoa, uh oh, that fairly large sphere is coming at me. Eat blah to earn more XP. The more XP you earn, the bigger you are. Block can be found near dangerous zones. Eat smaller cells and become, uh, be careful at dangerous zones such as tornado holes. All right, okay. All right, bud. No, I didn't need you. To, honestly, I, who asked? Nobody. What are you, what are you talking? Oh God, no. What was that? 100% not a fan of whatever the heck that is. Seems like sometimes we can move and then sometimes we're like, I don't know. I, I feel like I'm pulling against gravity occasionally. Not just when I'm like near a tornado hole. Although, you know, also when we're near a tornado hole, I listen, I love to hang out near tornado holes. Oh, oh God. Oh, geez. We got quite a lot of things going on right now. <laughs> listen, uh, oh man, I can't, I can't go over there. There's a thing to get over there. I know we are um, like the loosest interpretation of graphics right now. Like this game does have graphics. Okay, we, we are at the stage of the game where we are devouring everything. Well done, your cell seems to be adapted. It's time for the next generation. All right, reach the required value of experience. I, I want more experience. It looks like I can't get any bigger. Okay, next generation. This is where we find another cell, and then when two cells love each other very much, each generation opens a new perspective for evolution. Welcome to the relational adaptation. Your cell has evolved into a single species. Every species has its own basement home. Your home can store various materials for future production and allows you to edit your cell. All of the main task line on the far le on the left side of the screen. Move to the middle of your home. Press F to enter cell editor. Here we go. Here you go, bud. I pre-ordered the premium edition of Spore when I was a kid. And that was a lot of money for me. Like, I had saved a, for a long time to be able to do that. And I'm still bitter about it. I mean, I like Spore. I actually think Spore is an okay game, but it's certainly not the game that was promised in GDC... Uh, circa 2004 or whatever i can't remember when that uh will write 
presentation was shown where it, like we were dragging corpses out of out of bodies of water man that game you know th that was that was the very moment i knew i hated the term potential anyway welcome to sorry for that backstory welcome to the cell editor uh, villain freaking uh, origin story there you can fully uh, customize your cell with various parts each part has various values that create a unique identity of your species use right mouse button to orbit your camera blah 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 Left side, you can find available parts. Each part has its own attributes, such as speed, attraction, uh, defense, and damage. You see the little icon on the left corner of each part. Uh, the little icon indicates to the most valuable attribute of the part. If the icon of the part contains a star image um, in the right corner, it will be able to use a special ability during your playtime. Upper mount middle panel shows you the species name and current parts count each generation has certain limitations create your parts as much effective as possible there's a bit of a language barrier here in the right corner you can be found essential attributes as previously mentioned defense damage speed attraction will lead you to the rest of the journey bottom panel indicates the three essential organic parts that create you use these parts for basic body construction the bottom left panel indicates the snap features okay uh, to put any part of your cell, choose any part icon from the left and right. I, I would like to start building this. Please stop tutorializing. If you move the cursor over one of the essential parts, you can use extended features by pressing X, scrolling up. Okay. 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 I'm going to start skipping you, which means that I'm not, not going to understand how to play the game. You know, that's, uh, that's how that works. That's how, uh, Mafia works. You know, like you just skip the important parts of the game that allow you to understand how the game works. That's how that works. What do you mean? No. Okay. We are, uh, we are building something here. Uh, I want a tail. Let's get a tail. We do have snap. Let's turn snapping on. This is like a, a little kind of a cilia. Cilia. I don't know, we can rotate it. I don't know what rotating it does. Uh, I'd like to be fast. I definitely want to get some kind of, you know, facial um, weapon. Crust armor. Oh, I love crust armor. I kind of like this claw. Let's get this claw going. Oh, that looks pretty good. Let's get another one of the... Oh. Why is it so large? Uh, why is it so large? I don't understand how to shrink it. I thought maybe like zooming in or out. Maybe this because I have snapping turned on. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't know. It doesn't seem to. Hmm. Okay. Well, there's interesting problems to, to solve here. I want to I want to give him some eyes or something. I don't know. Okay. Flower. Gentle hair or beauty tail. Let's give him a flower. Let's give him a flower there and there. Give him like some googly flowers. That's gonna make, oh yeah, he's super attractive now. And I'm gonna turn snapping on. Um, turn snap axis Z. I guess we're on snap Z axis. What does this button do? I'm sure you would like to exit. No. No, I didn't mean to do that at all. All right, we want some gentle hair. No, that's that's more beauty. Let's uh, let's add some wings. I kind of wish there was like I, I thought I could turn on like symmetry. We don't seem to have symmetry features, which is unfortunate. This is looking pretty good. Oh yeah, we can we can change the color of our various parts. I want to pick like a complementing color. Um. Yeah, I mean pink and blue ish. Pink and pink and green is kind of nice too. I don't know. Um I think we can continue to add stuff like it it's not really telling us no. Let's just add another claw. Mm, yeah, there we go. Look at that. That's looking pretty good. I, I, you know, the novel thing here is we didn't have 3D cells in Spore. We only had two-dimensional cells. 
let's uh let's add a bunch of tails here this game kind of reminds me of uh there's another game called make a thing this uh, feels a little bit like make a thing okay we we're done there all right let's um let's finish let's see what we can do here pretty great great work your species is evolving pretty fast now to move around explore the world first step try to gather first uh resource material follow the thing on the mini map all right yes our lad truly is um quite the lad we can collect more stuff uh, honestly not much has changed since our uh origins gather the first resources follow something on the mini map okay so i am following uh actually i don't what, what do you mean what what mini map oh i see okay we have a mini map in the bottom left corner um all right so we're gonna try and find some of this blue stuff sodium each resource material allows you to enhance your species buy other cells at home buy valuable material at and more use the left mouse button to gather out of resources keep in mind that resource materials are limited however they will regenerate over time so we can gather out of resources oh i see so we need to we can only gather from this is, the game is quite heavy on the material uh sorry on the tutorialism um tutorialization which is you know good i like to understand the game i'm playing but also uh you know sometimes there's something to be said about like show uh don't tell what is this what is going on over here This is very strange looking. Well, I, I managed to grab some stuff. Return home to save gathered resources. Okay. So we got some we got some sodium. As you already know how to gather essential resources, it's time for an adventure. You can take some mates with you. Press Q. Press and hold Q to select the nearest cellmates. Press E to release your cellmates. The more cellmates you have, the more resources you can gather. Keep the company so you will be more protected against aggressive. Oh, is this an extraction game? Your cellmates will grow with a little yellow ball above their head. Great. Now explore the world and find other species. Okay, so let's grab some friends. Okay, so we've got three friends. They look very odd. Oh god, those are bad guys. I don't really have any means to defend myself, despite having three claws. Okay, we, we're gonna kill this lad here. I, I managed to kill him. We didn't seem to get anything from that, so I don't think there's, like, any benefit to, uh, killing lads. You, you do you do click a lot in order to gather resources explore the world and find other species by following semicircles on the map okay so this is a another species home maybe hard to tell I, th this game's got quite the strange art style I must say we can collect these we got some more materials valuable material. How come I can't pick it up? Known as vitamin B, can be found in some meats and fish. It won't let me collect it, and I don't know why. Okay. Looks to me like I can't collect these at all. Uh, it might be that I'm not evolved enough to, to accept that. These are enemies? Can we not be friends with these guys? Meet your first species. It's a neutral species. They will not harm you until you do. Each species has three types of roles. Worker, guardian, and explorer. 
Workers gather resources materials from the nearest resource zones. They are mostly slower and weaker. Guardians take place around their initial home. They are mostly slower but stronger. And then explorers leave their homes to explore the rest of the world. Something like you. They are mostly faster than the others. If you move the cursor over any species, you can see their essential information, including relational, uh, relational status. If you press left mouse button, you can attack the cell and their relational status will slowly grow to enemy. Each species is hungry for valuable material, which can be bought at your home for gathered material randomly found in swamp zones or you can obtain it by if you kill any species if you bring them correct valuable material you will be friends choose your species you would like to be friend with and don't forget to check uh out proper <laughs> valuable material so this game's like got a little bit more complexity than spore like we have uh, almost an rts aspect we have the friendship status that was a uh, bit more commonplace in in the species portion of the game quite a lot of things going on here so what what do they want um ganymedes attraction doesn't really say what they want i thought they oh god okay they have an enemy they seem to have a special ability to create a shield the everything in this game looks just odd new editor pa part found oh nice so there is a benefit to killing other cells hey lad are you not my friend you are a different species from me apparently all right let's uh we've we've put all of our stuff we can edit uh edit our cell Maybe we can put that new part on there. What is this? Electron. This is a uh, form of attack. And then we have spiky bone armor. Uh, Alright. I'm not sure how to like make our cell bigger. They did kind of explain it. But like it's it's a little bit odd. You like can I can I keep extending? You can't create more parts. Uh, all right so we can do that i mean we, we gave my dude a nipple nice i'll give him a little alarm uh, we're gonna create like the police cell we'll, we'll give it another one why not like we can go kind of wild with this actually let's give our dude some armor as well this this guy looks horrendous he's got kind of a mohawk We've got we've got some more bone armor. This is offering us some defense. This thing looks just absolutely awful. Great, fantastic. Ship it. All right, we can buy a guardian. Required thirty calcium and ten sodium. Let's buy uh, a guardian. Buy another one, and we can buy a worker buy another worker buy or find valuable proper valuable material to make new friends Let's buy another ex oh you can't afford it yo bud i'm not done with you in fact we're, we're what what are you my dude yo can you oh i see that's a that, that is a resource gather okay we want some sodium we're gonna go and uh maybe we can pick up that valuable resource now that I saw before. I don't know, like, we seem to take damage occasionally and I'm not sure why or how. Um, ah, there's those valuable resources. So can we pick, pick these up now? No. Oh, I can right click them. Maybe? Uh, it seems to me I this is like I guess I can bring it to someone. So, do you guys want this? What do you want? I I do not know what I'm doing. A little bit. We would like calciferol. I think that was over here. This is calciferol. I'm trying to right click it. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. We we left click it. 
Invaluable, uh, invalid valuable material has been given. The species wants... Okay, here we go. I'm going to bring that to you. Great work. You've achieved a friendship with the species. Each, each friendly species may offer you a teamwork request to assault other species. This may be a good opportunity to gain more reputation and experiences. And accept or decline the request for sure. Also, you are able to trade generic material with your new friends. You've gone through all the basics in this generation. Now explore the rest of the world. Make new relationships and find other editor parts. If you find need any... Okay, we're, we're, we're good. So, uh, yeah, can we, can I, no, I can't take you on as a friend. That would, that would be good if we could. I've got some calcium. Let's, uh, maybe we can destroy these lads. These guys have shields. The guardians, we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and destroy this nest if we can. We're gaining some valuable experience. Seems like they're replenishing. We are taking damage. Oh, that's my friend. Whoops. We got a new new editor part. Excellent. Well, this seems like, um, both like, like it's got some chops, it's got some complexity to it, but also it's a fairly shallow, but that doesn't necessarily ha you know, that's not necessarily a problem. Is this my friend? I can't tell who my enemy is. Okay, there we go. All right, let's get another friend here. Explore the rest of the world and it, okay. These guys are attacking us, which is no good. I, I will say um, something that is not impressive to me is like how the nests are in such a grid format. It really leads to some very kind of like stagnant exploration because like, yeah, we can we can go and explore and look at other stuff, but like everything's laid out in a very it's too organized, you know, it's it's far too organized. Oh, God, what is that? Uh, I'm not really sure what this is and what we do with it. We got some valuable material. Can we, can we, we can take this home, right? We can, but it doesn't, I think these are only meant to like, we, we are only meant to, to like give this to someone else. We don't actually do anything with it ourselves. Okay, you can go away now. I don't I don't actually need to see you anymore. Um So I, I have to I think maybe this is just like providing my home with some more resources. We can we can destroy another nest. See uh see what that provides us with. Found another part. All right, so we, we did that again. Whatever that is, we did it. Well done, your cell seems to be adapted. It's time for the next generation. Okay. So, I mean, we're, we're kind of like, we've got a spore thing going on where the game develops and, uh, you know, I don't know. We, I, I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Welcome to the biological adaptation. Uh, your species is progressing really fast and there is a new material type available magnesium now you're able to build new structures new types of editor parts have appeared new world features appeared and your reputation level has rapidly increased are we being attacked right now if you move to the middle of your home you will see the build category which allows you to build various structures it seems like we've included the entire um the entirety of like spore but like instead <laughs> we've just localized it entirely into the cell phase of the game um which is a you know interesting strategy here you guys are like actively preventing me from like using my own home i'd like to edit my my cell i will say the game does not run very well it's not running too well for me 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of some parts because we have some better parts now. I want to I want to try these spiky horns. Oh my god, that's that's horrendous. I truly hate it. Let's uh, add like 15 of them to my my creepy dude. I kind of wish you could like grow your cell a little bit so that it's a bit bigger and there's more room for like parts. But that doesn't mean you can't be creative with it. I guess we can kind of no, we can't. Never mind. We need more speed. Um, nothing I've done really lends much to our speed. Uh, we could do some reapers. Let me see here. This is speed one, speed two, speed two. Organic gland offers some, some whatever, nothing really. These electrons are, are good for us. Also, I, another, I don't know, maybe I'm, I'm being very highly critical of the game. But um, I find that uh, this like building of our cell is very shallow. Like I wish different parts actually did different things. I guess if they have a star, they do something. But uh, I haven't really seen any like examples of, the, of, of me having different abilities. Oh, we have a, a metasomal, whatever that is. Okay, we'll just like go ahead and slap it on there. Look at that. Well, I, we added it to our nipple. Great. So we have biological adaptation now. All right, let's 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 uh, get our grotesque, uh, you know, man-made abomination out there. Turret. Defend your home against aggressive species. Okay, so these guys have turrets. There's a lot of lads out here. They're all neutral, which is nice. And then, okay, we've got some stuff uh you're also neutral let's see if maybe someone wants this thing you guys want what do you want you want calciferol i don't have cur cur um invalid yeah okay that's fine I, you don't want it that's fine um you guys are also neutral but this is a zone for gathering materials to keep looking actually i seem to have lost my valuable material i don't know what happened to it okay there it is okay let's see if maybe there's a nest up here that wants this because uh, whatever it is i don't know you you want the some something blue um enemies well, i haven't really seen any enemies yet which is good it's a good problem to have Uh, this is Nia Niacin. It's weird how like some of the um, material on the ground kind of reacts to the player, but others don't. So what do you guys want? Ah, you want Theamin. That's not what I have, right? Yeah, I have Niacin. Okay, well. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm going to be super... Um, honest here, I, I am very whelmed by this gameplay. Highly whelmed. What do you want? You want paired something something. I, I can go and get some materials. I'm actually full up on materials. I have a... Oh, cool. I've got... I do have new abilities. Okay. I've got a laser beam now. Nice. We'll go and uh, I'm gonna go and drop off my stuff. No one wants what I what I've got. These guys are just explorers. I wish they would not prevent me from entering my home. Um, we can build a cell house. Can you guys stop? Jesus. Required. We need calcium and sodium. Great. Now you can spawn more cells and create a massive army. I don't know if I want to do that. To be honest, it's already feeling a little crowded right now. Uh, uh, can you guys, for real, for real though, oh my god, please, production, <laughs> I actually cannot move, this is, this is, this needs, this actually needs fixing, yo, this is, this is broken, this is broken, my dude, I just want to access my home, okay, <laughs> okay, 
All right, I guess I, I guess I will not. I guess I will not. It's fine. Let's go find something to kill before I lose my patience. Are you guys killable? Neutral. Seems to me I can pick and choose my enemies now. Let's just pick an enemy. Okay. Ouch. I mean, it's fine. Honestly, it's very fine. Like, nothing seems to hurt me too much in this game. I like the animation for when they explode. I don't like how... Okay, we got a new parts. I don't like how they just, like, have a shield and then I can't do anything about it. Craft your own cell parts and advanced cells. So we can destroy their stuff. They have four more cells. I, I like that it tells me how many things I have to kill. We are taking quite a bit of damage from these lads. The turret does not seem to do anything. I wonder, like, I wonder if it can do anything if I, like, walk right up to it. Are you guys attacking me? What the heck? I didn't hurt you. All right, well... This is, uh, this is a game. Um, what is this? Uh, it teleports you, so maybe you can find other, like, a better place teleporters that will actually, like, help you. All right. Uh, I'm gonna call it for sellings. Um, I am unimpressed, to say the least, but, you know... Maybe someone out there who really liked Spore and wants, uh, you know, to, to fill a niche. I, I think that if you like the cell stage of Spore, I, I, I would recommend you check out Thrive, which I haven't uh, covered on the channel yet, but I should. Um, not to just like blatantly recommend a different game. Uh, I, you know, I hate to do that, but I don't know. This one's not impressing me too much. But either way, this is Sellings. Maybe you do like it. And uh, if you did, if you like this video, maybe hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And um, be sure to check out the Game Development World Championship site for other undiscovered gems. And uh, if you're a developer, you could submit your game. So some kind of snarky YouTuber can cover it. I don't know. <laughs> so you can actually win some prizes. That's that's That would be why you would want to do that. But um, anyway... Either way, I, I hope you enjoyed this. Take it easy. Uh, take it easy, and I'll see you guys next time.